questionable. Be respectful. You walk through hallowed halls. Shut up, nerd. I do what I want. Where's this guy? Is he in here? Hello? There you are. Seriously, you have like a science project. Is, are you building a planetarium on your head? That's kind of what it looks like. Hi, Confessor. Like. <laughs> yes. What is it, child? Hey, what's up? <laughs> I was just admiring your sense of fashion. Uh, I'd like to help the fanboy. I'd like to help the family. Is there anything I can do? Eager. There is a member of our little community I've suspected for some time now. My own inquiries have proven fruitless. But your relative newness will likely make it easier for you to sniff out the truth. I would have you investigate this person. Should you find proof of any heresy or disloyalty, you are to bring it to me. So you can be trusted and you'll be rewarded. Wow, gee, more persecuting heretics. Sounds fun. What exactly am I looking for? Hard evidence of any plots against myself, the family, or disrespect towards Holy Adam. Such transgressions cannot be allowed to stand. Are you sure? Because I've been doing that a lot, like disrespecting Adam left and right this entire episode, and no one's done shit to me so far. So, whatever. Consider it done. Superb. Bring whatever you find directly to me. Here. Yeah, I'll think about it. The person it. in question. Leave no stone unturned. This is a chance to prove your value to Adam. Right, I got you. All right, let's check it out. Uh, what was it? I confessor's note. Here we are. Let's check it out. Aubert. Oh, Aubert. Aubert. I know it's weird. Dog me. I did not forget you ate a bug earlier. That was gross. You dog. No dog treats for you. You filled up on bugs the earlier. The confessor's word is All the right. word of Aubert. Aubert. I think she's down there. I'm fair. Yeah! Hello. I'm going to If you're looking for face. the crypt, you took a wrong turn. My job to take care of this place. You touch anything, I'm taking the limb. Understand? Wow, sassy. What do you do around here? You said it was your job to take care of this place? The vessel, yes. One of the most powerful sources of glow on an island full of it. My job to make sure it's looked after. You get in the way of that, you'll have to answer to Adam. But first, you'll have to answer to me. <laughs> Adam will get what's left. Mm, right. I kill people all the time, I'd like, to, like you to know. Just saying, whatever. What can you tell me about the sub? Never launched anything, if that's what you're asking. Never even made it out of the bay during the Great Division. All the better. Preserved it for us. Sure. Uh, right. I'm supposed to be investigating you. What the heck am I doing? Why build a crypt in the sub? Don't you have the entire base? Keeps our fallen brethren near his glow. Near their family. Only spotted child should spend eternity. A true honor. Denied to too many. That's stupid. Why would someone be denied a place in the crypt? You've been out there, right? This place. It's dangerous. Take a wrong turn in the fog? Sorry, brother. Lost to the family. Wandered too close to the wrong settlement. Lost to the family. Adam, help you. You look at Tectus the wrong way. Oh? So you don't like Tectus, you say? You don't like Tectus, huh? Who wouldn't? Man's a damn... Uh, that is... Uh, I... Uh, I like Tectus just fine. But I... Uh, I think you should go. Hmm, interesting, interesting. I detect a hint of heresy going on here. I think further investigation is required. I am looking at your bunk. This is your bunk, right? I think it's your bunk. Hello. Edgar's note. My dear Albert, no, you worry too much, even if the High Confessor is still having trouble getting over my past closeness with Martin. Richter is a friend. If there was a problem, the Grenzel would tell me. That said, I think you and I should continue using our footlocker in the storage room to share messages. You know how gossip spreads in this place. I wouldn't want you getting drawn into any undue intrigue. And in case yours has wandered off again, I've hidden the spare key behind the bench 
in entryway lock in the entryway locker room just in case counting the moments until we're together edgar oh my shucks it's a love note oh we found love in alone i don't know the words of that song dog me dog me dog me don't be sad dog me i know you're sad because you're living on a a ration of bugs at the moment but you're gonna have to grin and bear it friend okay uh right so we need to find a key so we can rummage through this lady's stuff so we can find out if she's a heretic and find out if we get to kill her or not this is messed up man we're, we're, we've been over this and I'm over it. Now we go back to radiation hell in the submarine. You can hear me. Shut up! Where? Please leave me. Oh, you know what? After I'm sorry. done with dealing with this heretic, I'm gonna deal with your ass next. You absolute bastard. Okay, you wanna know something? You wanna know why I really hate this place? It's not the ideological thing, right? Where they're all kind of a bunch of dicks. Right? It's not even that. It's not even that. It's that whenever you're hanging out in this place, there's so much mumbling going on. There's people like under, like whispering shit to Adam or something, and it's just so irritating being here all the time. With that shit going on in my headset. It's, I cannot stand it. Okay, where am I? I went to the wrong place. And I'm ranting. I'm sorry. My dog. My dog is eating bugs. I'm doing quests I don't like. There's mumbling going on. I'm on edge. That's all I'm saying. Okay. What do we got here? Albert's note. Is it Albert? Maybe it's Albert. It could be Albert. I don't know. I don't speak French. Let's see. Where is this? Albert's note. Edgar Granzelet says it was an accident. You wandered off alone and he couldn't get to you in time. Couldn't bring you back. He's lying. I know because you'd never do something that foolish. None of them will ever admit to it, but this was Tectus. He had you killed because he's terrified of Martin. Because Tectus knows Martin was the only one worthy of running this family. Adam above, I need you, Edgar. You tell me what to do right now. What keeps coming to mind I know is a bad idea until we're together again all bared all right all right all right all right it sounds like this lady nothing more to is say to planning some shit Let's sister Bear, I found this note you penned about the high confessor something like this could get you in a lot of trouble my note my note uh Listen, uh, I, I was mad. I confess there's a good man. I, I, I wouldn't. I, please, please, just, just, just let me have it back and I'll get rid of it. We can pretend this never happened. Please. You need to get out of here. Look, no matter what I do, you're not safe here. You need to leave now. Shit, you're right. Shit. Just, um... Give me a little time before you say anything, all right? Please. All right, bounce! I feel like we've done some good today. We've told two people to get out of this whole Adam business, man, because it's no good. It's no good, long fella. Not good at all. You know what is good? Them glasses. Make it quick, will you? All right, okay. <laughs> We're done. I had nothing to say in the first place. Okay. I, I wanted to do something with that, uh, Mr. Mumbles. I'm pretty sure this might be the only fun mission here. It might be. Wait, are you? What are you doing here? Gwyneth. No, seriously, what are you doing? I told you to run. Why are you here? What? Oh, Why would you come here? Come. You, you're me. mumbling. It drives oh. me insane. I, I don't think oh. Sister Gwyneth is supposed to be did I not tell him to run? I'm pretty sure I told him to run. Excuse me. Yeah? I mean, glory to a- Wait, you're the new convert. You happen to see Brother Devin, the sickly guy, praying off by himself. Yeah, Mr. Mumbles, I seen I him. I think so. Is he the one with the propellers and the periscope? 
I mean, he's kind of hard to mess. No, he'd be the skeletal one with all his hair falling out. See, Brother Devon, he's been on a fast, a long one. No food, only irradiated water, waiting for a sign from Adam. Most folks would say that's real admirable, giving yourself to Adam like that. What do you think? I think that's stupid as shit. Sounds nuts to me. Adam above, someone else. Look, Thank you. Me and Devin, we're, we weren't born with Adam's blessing like everyone else around here. Rads, they hurt us. Now Devin thinks fasting and refusing meds till he dies is gonna get Adam to grant him some kind of revelation or something. I've tried talking to him, but he won't listen to me anymore, and everyone else in this place thinks what he's doing is a brilliant idea. I, I know we don't know each other, but if you could convince him to quit, I'd owe you. Could give you some anti-rad meds I've cooked up. Recipe, too. Damn handy for folks like us. What do you say? Talk to him for me? I will do this. I don't even care about the reward as long as it gets someone else to stop being so damn crazy. Okay, sure. I'll talk to him. Oh, thank you. Please, just do it quick, alright? He's starting to look bad. Starting to look bad? Have you seen the people around here? I hate to see what looking bad is. Everybody looks freaking bad. Glory Jesus. God. Okay. Brother Devin, Mr. Mumbles. Uh, what's up? Hi there. Holy Adam. From this spot. I... I... Is that you? Oh, holy... Oh. I... I'm sorry, sister. I thought you were... Never mind. Did you need something? Yeah, uh, you need a hobby. You just... <laughs> oh, I crap, suppose I, I look a mess at this point. But I... I can't leave. Adam came to me. And I will follow his command. Right. And if Adam told you to jump off a cliff, would you? I see what you're trying to do. <laughs> but it's not going to work. For sure? I have seen his messenger with my own eyes. Jet has been my crutch for many years. Ah, mine One day, too. I was in the woods, polluting myself. Fun. When a figure strode from the sky before me. A verdant stag, wreathed in holy glow. It commanded me to return to the nucleus, and to leave behind my iniquities, and give myself fully to Adam. For my dedication, Adam would send another messenger, who would free me from my shackles once and for all. That, sister, is why I must wait. <laughs> right, um... Boy, is it your lucky day. I have good news. I am Atom's messenger, and I have come to free you from your shackles. There. Now, um, let's just keep this between us, okay? You're the... You're the messenger? <laughs> it worked! The shackles are gone? They are, aren't they? Yep, oh, totesies. Thank you. thank you, your brilliance. And don't fear, messenger. I will keep your secret. Oh, Adam above, thank you. I can't. Oh man, we done a good. We messenger. done a good today. Yeah, now stop mumbling, you weirdo. Fucking mumble. That's there's so many other mumblers around here. It drives me I insane. Hey, yeah, yeah, like that one. I will wipe. You did it. Hate the shorts. Adam above, you did it. Here, anytime I brew a new batch, you can have some. And if there's anything else I can do for you, you let me know. Right on. So, you seem sane. Why are you here? You mentioned before you're affected by radiation. Why would you choose to live in a place like this? Sure beats where I came from. Before joining the family, I was a trapper. Lived with a nasty bunch out in the fog. Barely scraping by. Kind of place you slept with a knife under your pillow to make sure no one stole your food. But one day, out hunting, we stumbled upon High Confessor Tectus and his crew on their way to a pilgrimage. We surrounded them, took them captive. Figured we could ransom them back for some grub and ammo. I pulled guard duty, and me and the High Confessor get to talking. You can probably figure out what happened next. Mm, he converted ya. You. you turned on the trappers? Mm-hmm. The High Confessor started describing the life I could have at the Nucleus, 
With Adam, three meals a day. Not having to worry about getting eaten in my sleep. Radiation wasn't even that much worse. Plus, I had my brew to handle that. Ended up being a pretty easy decision. I helped the children clean out the trappers and started my new life here. So, something else I can do for you? You know, you could always just check out one of my settlements. I got tons of them, man. But I'm good. So, yeah, what's up with you and Devin? Why do you care so much about Devin? I mean, he's a good kid. Sure, he likes his jet a little too much, but it's not like he was out raiding. He just needed a hand. And lucky for us both, you showed up. Huh. Kinda makes you wonder if Adam didn't have a part in this after all. So, was there something else? I don't think Adam had anything Didn't to need do with anything at the moment. All right, then. Take care of I yourself. Think, I think... I think... It was just people helping each other out. Holy shit! What a concept! It's something we all should do, and for some reason, we attribute it to some divine Far entity's will. will. What the fuck? Just light. Jeez, why did we sell ourselves short like this? Let's get out of here. Going back to Far Harbor, man. I need... I need a brand of crazy that I can deal with. Not this Adam shit. I'm so done with it. 